trigonometric ratios for angles in standard position. Let P, X, Y be a point on a circle centered at 0, 0 with radius R that rotates through an angle theta. The point P, X, Y is on the terminal arm of the angle theta in standard position. You can see here that the point P is on the terminal arm and we are in quadrant 1 for our example. We can then make a triangle with the x-axis. The sides of the triangle are made up of the x and y values of our point P. The terminal arm is the radius of the circle, R. We can always find R using Pythagoras. x squared plus y squared equals r squared. We can square root both sides and we get R is equal to the square root of x squared plus y squared. Now recall all three trig ratios, or use SOHCAHTOA to help you remember. We can use these ratios to define sine, cosine, and tangent of theta in terms of x, y, and r. Sine of theta, which is the opposite over the hypotenuse, becomes y over r. Cosine of theta, which is the adjacent over the hypotenuse, becomes x over r. Tangent of theta, which be, is the opposite over the adjacent, becomes y over, over x. Note that although the diagram shows theta in quadrant 1, the ratios would be the same in all four quadrants. The only difference would be the signs of the three ratios being either positive or negative.